that's pretty cool. We just got the Heraldic D Shield. Not bad at all. That is cool. We plan to do a lot of Vorkath, and that's going to come in handy for sure. Well, that is really, really, really bizarre. So I just used my last Slurp Juice. I'm completely out of supplies. I figure this will be my last kill. It happened to be my last kill on task. So I only I got lucked out. I only had one left to kill. I got the pet and I got Uncut Onyx on the same drop. That was by far like the weirdest coincidence like ever. That was, that was crazy. But we did we did finish up. You know the drill. At this point, I will um, I'll just loot everything and then I'll show you what we have. Uh, I'll show you the highlights rather. Just open this up. Damn, you know I was looking at Elite Mystery Boxes? They have some really good loot. It's just, you have to get lucky. <laughs> um, I was looking at them, they have some crazy, they have like, they, you can get a Lygian Spirit Shield from them, you can get um, Rapier, you can get the Obsidian Armor, Ancestral, you can get some really good stuff, it's just, everybody's, every time I open one, I always get unlucky like, exactly like this, but, you know, whatever. It's 10 mil, or rare components, I'll probably just take the rare components. Oh, nice, a balloon spawned. Look at all these nerds. Look at all these nerds. I was just, I just like went to like the first place and got super lucky it's here. That, that's how I envisioned the loot balloon when I coded it, was that people would just like rush it and whoever got it first would win. That was, that was the envision and, and, and that's, that's sort of, that's sort of kind of how it is, although I don't know how many people actually look. The loot balloon can give you good stuff and it's not so much what you can get, it's what you're guaranteed to get. I got, I got 15 crystal keys, and I believe both of these clue boxes are guaranteed. So no matter what happens, at the very least, you get both of those. I think you get puck points too, I thought, but it doesn't say. Let me look. Okay, so I'm looking at it, and you do get puck points. You actually get raid points, too. You get 250 raid points and uh, 1,000 puck points. So I'm going to add a little message to the code that tells you that. Because I don't think a lot of people know that, and if you're not looking at your quest tab, you might not even notice. Hey, just got a dark light. That's actually pretty nice, because it got buffed recently. And I didn't have one. I should have the shards. Let me check. Nope, I still need 10 shards, but I will definitely work towards that nowadays. Because the uh, arc light would be cool. Got some random chests here, as per usual. Can we clutch anything out? It's not really looking like it, no. We have enough scale, so let's do another totem. See what we get. <clears throat> Love it. Love it. So good. So good. So the entire time I was in Ash's dungeon, I was killing Bloodvelds and was able to get 2,600 points. Buy those two bonds. Puts us at 1,000 donated points. Hmm. I think I'm just going to go to Elite Mystery Boxes. I don't really know what else is even worth getting in here. Let me, let me look her. Staff of the Dead would be okay, I guess. Uh... Gate Armadale piece or Bando's piece. That'd be, that would save me some trouble, but I, I think I'm still going to just go with the Elite Mystery Boxes. I have a lot of faith in these. We're going to get something crazy. We're about to get an Elijah and we're calling it. No. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> Alright, so there was a new update, and there's a player appreciation event going on right now. And part of it is this little thing right here where you can donate these weapons to the pirates. Um, costs 10 mil to do, so you get a goodie bag, a large goodie bag per. And what we're going to do is we're just going to buy, I think I'm going to go my entire cash deck. I'm going to go, I'm going to go for the big dick opening right away. So there, I, there's the, the thing with these is there's a lot of crappy items, but there's a lot of like really good stuff in there. That's at, that's at like at the higher end of it. You know what I mean? So the likelihood of us getting anything good, maybe not too high, but I'm definitely going to, uh, I'm definitely going to try. So let me be right back with all of them. All right. Let's see what we got. That is 500. I have no ash money. I got nothing. I'm, I'm, I'm going all out on these large cash bags. Or these large goodie bags. Let's do it. I'll be happy with like one big item. That's it. That's all I want from those 52. Like I don't know what the odds of a big item are. But that's all I'm going for. Just one big item. Oh, a special box. Nice. Nice. We'll save that. We'll save that. Pretty much everything in it is good, so it does have a couple lower end items like the Elite Mystery Boxes, but it's pretty good. Oh, Mossy Key's nice. This okay, so this thing right here is is the thing that um it's Oh Banner's chest plate, nice. That sucks that it's a chest plate because we have the obsidian plate buddy. Dang. Not bad though. Not not a bad item. 
Uh, but anyways, the Masi Key is going to be used for a boss that is not in the game yet, so just save those for later. And if you examine it, it tells you that. No, it doesn't. Uh, why does that not... <laughs> Never mind, I guess I'm a liar. I'm very confused as to why that doesn't... Why, I don't, okay. Alright, never mind, I'm a liar, I'm a dirty liar. Twelve more. Unsired, nice. Oh, another special box, nice. And then two more. Another Mossy Key, nice. Nice, those are gonna be good, uh, trust me, it's for, it's for a boss that, kind of like the big snake boss, there, where you fight it and then it has good loot. Um, so we did get one big item with the, the chest plate. I don't know if the, these aren't considered big. I think they're just uncommon. So, um, but yeah, that's that's cool. I wish it would have been the legs. I probably will just disassemble that. To be completely honest with you, I don't know. Save it for now. Oh, come on, come on, please something good. Yes, yes, that's awesome, dude. That's cool. Nice ranger boots, man. Wow. Awesome. I might be like, well, I don't know if, I don't know how most people feel about that, but I'm stoked. That's, that's a good loop. All right, I, I mean, it was 500 mil. I, I, I yeah, yeah, I would say, I, I would say that was a jab. I mean, that was, we, we did good. I think we got out, I got, we got pretty lucky with that. We got some keys and stuff open. I'll show, if anything interesting happens, I'll show you, but if not, I'll just be back with a different clip. Good thing about the goodie bags is even if you don't get anything great, you always get pug points, so... Oh, nice. That's not bad. We missed your bucks. Membership. Stated. Uh, well, anyways, we have a unique box. And we're going to get something super good from it. Oh, that's actually not bad. That's not bad. Uh, the funny thing is, like, let me show you. <laughs> or if you already know, because you have good memory. Uh, I'm saving up for Beads of the Dead. I have 4.2 million Numulite that I was saving to buy this. So now that means I get to spend all of that on mystery boxes. So that is going to be the next clip, uh, a, a nice load of mystery boxes. Wow, 100 on the dot. That's kind of funny. Let's uh, let's open. It's gilded, or oh, mahogany chest. No, no. Oh. Oh, okay. That was that dude. That made me think I just fucked up my bank. I was. Second turn for a half a second there. There's a lot of cash stuff back. That's not bad. We just spent all of our money. Like, literally every single penny I had. And we're about to go do it again. I'm about to do it a lot this event just to try to maximize the potential. Well, the last, like, a few events, I didn't really play the server that much. Not as much as I should have. So, this event, I'm, I'm definitely going to get my, uh... Definitely get my hours in. Nothing crazy, but we did get this, and you never know. I feel like most of the time I just get shit, but every once in a while, man, they do have the they have the potential. They all do. It's just gotta get lucky. That's what I, I mean. That's the piece I need. So in a sense, that's that's nice, but no, that's not nice. I don't like it. <laughs> Nice! I just got a mysterious schematic from the Sea Troll Queen. I'm like 230 kills dry at the boss, uh, Butin Tarn, and I'm never gonna do it again because I cheated it out of this here. So works out great for everybody. Hey! I just got a Primordial Crystal. That's actually really cool from Oak Chest Two too. Nice. We got ourselves Prims. Yeah. All right. So we have enough pug points for another unique box. We are going to go unique box. I don't really need much from it now. I, I got the main thing I wanted. So we're just kind of hoping for something unique. Not that. I mean, that's. I guess I got a new hat to wear. <laughs> huh, that's weird. My clip just glitched out right there. I got a Vorkath head, yeah. So that, that's really the only thing I got from all my upgrades. This, this little lot of stuff cost 500 mil. <laughs> so was it worth it? No, but we did get a Vorkath head upgrade. That's nice. How many puck points do we have? 27,000. Is that accurate? Yeah, so we're, we're almost towards another unique box. So we got ourselves a Zalander Totem. Mm, bad. Bad, bad. Wow, we uh, we actually just got a Rapier from Mystery Box. That is a duplicate. Um, that's crazy, because that's pretty rare. I don't know... I don't know of any, like, useful way to 
to, to you know use it you know what I mean like I don't think it's worth disassembling or selling or anything so I guess I just have two rapiers now I ended up getting a bond from something a mystery box so we're gonna buy a another elite mystery box let's do it I, I have faith I'm a believer that's that's not bad I'll take that sure with a few more mystery boxes we managed to get to 3500 points let us buy another unique box and get super lucky and be happy. That's, I mean, that's cool, but I, I, like, I don't need that no more. That's useless. Damn. I got this from a goodie bag earlier. Please, blowpipe. Oh, damn. You know what? I'm actually just going to keep that. I've gotten three of them now. I actually just got that Staff of the Dead, as you probably saw a couple minutes ago. We might as well, right? We might as well. All right, so I had to do a, do some experiments real quick, but we now have enough paper scraps to combine them, and we can alk it, and hopefully get some good dank money and not get screwed. Please be something good. Oh, that's nice. That's so nice that I might actually not alk that. Crap. That's too nice. Oh, I uh, that's like I think that's the second best one because I think the imbued eye is a little bit better. I mean, Butte Eye probably would have been better to me because I would have definitely just out that. But the look of the pugs is uh, 250 mil. So that's 125 mil if we out that. The thing is, I want to make a look of the pugs. So it would make more sense to save 125 mil and keep it and then out it. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't think I'm even close to the Uber or the Rare components. I have halfway on the Rares. The Ubers, I'm a little bit behind, but I suppose I could alk some or not I, I I don't know I guess I could try to I could try to work towards it yeah I'm definitely gonna keep that though I don't think I'm gonna alk that so never mind but that is still very nice to get though that's awesome this will be my first Sliske kill if we can actually manage to kill it with these this next few uh, hits I don't know if that actually did kill it I guess not <laughs> that's that's gotta be it <laughs> Okay, that's gotta be it. Alright, first kill. First kill of Sliske, we get Battle Stabs. Not bad. And whenever this thing dies, that'll be our second kill. is actually not that bad. I did die. <laughs> I won't lie. But that was mostly because the dragon does more damage than I expected. I don't think the shield helps. Which it should, so that's something I'm gonna look into. But there we go, second kill. A two kill boxes. A Ripperino. I got a special test that gave me Sliske and I thought I'd give it a go. I actually think Sliske is pretty doable with this gear. Obviously, it could be better. could have some small upgrades, but it's doable. It's doable, and I like that. And kill number three. I'm not going to show you every kill. I suppose I'll just show highlights. But I did want to point out that I am doing some Sliske, and I think it's easy. So I'm probably going to do a couple more kills, just uh, at least at least this task. So at least four more kills. Um, I'll be back if I get anything. So I thought about it a little bit, and one of the best items I can probably get for Sliske is Ballista, because Ballista actually hits the Mime Phase. I don't know if most people know that. Ballista is really one of those items that used to be broken, it used to be overpowered. Does anybody remember those days? Do you guys remember those old school revival days where Ballista was the best in slot? I believe that was before Twisted Bow and everything, but um, nowadays no one really uses it. But I think it could be good for Sliske, so... I'm going to get that, and then what that allowed me to do is not have to switch styles. I can just main one style, and that'll be um, just a lot more efficient. And then I honestly think we're good to go for Sliske. I think I can, like, legit kill some Sliske. So I might actually work on the corrupt, uh, the corrupt, what is it? I think it's just called corruption, yeah. I'm going to work on the corruption, and then if I can get two of those, that's my Armadale. And I'll, go, I'll go immediately to Armadale and, uh, and put those all together. But, yeah, we just got the monkey tail, and I'm going to try to stay here and, and get the other piece as well.